Welcome back to another vlog. It's your one and only shells. Before we get into the video, make sure you like this video because y'all don't be liking the video. Simply shell, simply shell. You're watching her on YouTube, and you know she got a vibe for me. She got a vibe. Kids are home for winter break because Christmas is slowly approaching. How many days till Christmas? Five. I'm about to go out with Mia. She's going to be my little helper. I have to get some last minute stuff, return some stuff, get some more wrapping paper, some tape, and just a little bit, a little bit, a little bit of some, some, some. So you guys know when I'm outside, I'm outside. I want to bring you guys with me. Just wanted to open the vlog up and get the day started. Hope you guys are doing good. I hope you guys are feeling in the Christmas spirit. Fit of the day. Got this outfit from Julie She. I don't really know how I feel about it, but it's comfy, so I'm putting it on because it's a little on the chilly side today. It's giving mom attire, honestly. This is me. Comfort over anything. I don't know if I should put my Air Force Ones on or should I put the Panda Dunks on. I'm a little disappointed because I went and treated myself for Christmas to get these retros. I saw them online and I thought they, that they would be so dope, but when I got them and I tried them on, I don't know what a different thing. Honestly, these are a little small. These are a four and a half, but I didn't really like how they looked on my foot. So I'm just going to return them back and, I don't know, get something else maybe. Just left them off. And I returned my sneakers. Mm -hmm. And now we're going to go to Walmart. Yes, we're going to go to Walmart now. Holy world. Mia just saw somebody she had a crush on. Mia has a crush. I don't even know why I'm in this aisle, but y'all better help me because... The Temptations is real. I really want to dye my hair. I don't know if I'm going to do ginger or jet black. I heard this flat was good too, but I don't know if it works on like my hair tape or not. I love Candy Land. What are you thinking? So I think you should get this because he loves strippers. All right, grab that. Just when I say I'm not going to go too crazy, I end up going crazy. So why not? Oh, look at that baby alive, Mia. She's so cute. What about some punching gloves for him? He got a lot of energy. You think I like these so you guys can fight? Four hours later. Finally, back home. We went everywhere. Macy's going to Hot Topic. Me? We went to Marshall's, Walmart, to Walmart, Target. We went everywhere. All together, we went to like seven stores. If you do not have to go to Marshall, do not go to Marshall. The line was ridiculous. We were online literally for like an hour. But if I didn't have to return what I did, then I wouldn't have went. I returned my sneakers. So we went to the mall. Then we got something to eat. But I got everything that I needed. So I'm going to do a quick little haul with you guys. Because got some Capri Suns for the kids. Got some Ritz crackers, some goldfish, and some little chestnut cookies. Because you know we snacks over here. I'm a big snack. Not a foodie, a snack. I got some Fabuloso multi-purpose bleach cleaner. I haven't tried the blue one, so let's see. Because I don't remember the last time I mopped my floors. I'll be honest with you. So we're going to do a nice deep cleaning. This is one of the best glass cleaner for Get Windex because there's no streaks. And it just, I like the foamy consistency. And then I also got this Myers Clean Day multi-surface uh, everyday cleaner. I usually get the green one, but I wanted to try this one. In the scent, honeysuckle. Some scrub and wipe absorbent flexi scrubbing because I'm gonna do this refrigerator. Got some sponges to wash the dishes. Some gloves and I also got this sponge daddy, the scrub daddy. I like it. I don't know why. I don't think it really works because I remember buying. Was it mom? Was it scrub mommy? A mommy scrub. What is it called, Mia? Mommy scrub. Yeah, scrub mommy. I think I had the scrub mommy and I don't really like it. So we're gonna try the scrub daddy and see if the daddy show up better than the mommy show up. Cute mixing bowl. Giving Christmas. Y'all know this is a necessity. Scott is the only tissue I use. Paper towel, because it's always something that I never have in my kitchen. I always run out of paper towel. I have a bad habit of just like pulling the pieces off just because I see it there. So I go through paper towel like it's nobody's business. You guys say Red Baron or Red Baron? I say Red Baron. I always try the regular, but I wanted to try something different. These are the French bread singles. I think I might pop these bad boys in here right now. Red Baron gonna get you right every single time, especially when you don't feel like cooking and you don't feel like spending no money on a whole pie. I don't know where I seen it, but I tried the cream, the lotion, and when I tell you this had melatonin in it, I slept like a baby the last few nights and I was looking for the oil because I heard the oil was better. I went to two different Walmarts and I finally found it, so 
I got this. Dr. Teal's is the go anywhere. I usually use the Dr. Teal's Epsom salt, like stuff, you know, when you're sick or your body's aching. I use that, but baby, if you have trouble sleeping and you need something to unwind to, get this. Right now I'm going to put all this away and then I'm going to tackle my refrigerator because my refrigerator has, it's giving, I'm embarrassed. I have let my refrigerator get crazy. And I got here to this house. I was going to do what I did in New York, but listen, a lot be going on. <laughs> Bacon. Let's get it going. Should we trust her bacon, y'all? Trust me. Okay, you're getting fancy with it. It looks like chocolate. It tastes like chocolate, too. We need one cup of water. Eggs. Okay. Okay. And. Come on now. Got it. Chef me in the building. No. Wait, 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 wait. Don't be wasting nothing. Put all them crumbs in there, girl. You got to get every nook and cranny in that bowl. Okay. All right. You've been so clingy these last couple of days. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's my fault. I think it's the breastfed babies that are the most clingy because I can't get rid of them. That's one cup, right? Yeah. Got it? Yeah. I think we should have used butter instead of oil. Yeah, you want me to crack the eggs or you going to risk it all for us and give us some eggshells in our cookies? No shells. Should we let him do it? Should we let this cutie do it? Should we let this cutie do it? Yeah? Yes. 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 Mom, what are you making? We're making red velvet. Oh, I love it. I love that. All right, ready? So mommy showed you like this, look. Stay still, you, you gotta stop moving around if you wanna cook. So when you crack an egg, you gotta go like this, you hit it on this, and then you open it up. I'ma let you do it. Crack it and put it, you gotta put it in a bowl. And once you get it on my hands. Oh, you don't wanna get it on your hands. Oh, that was easy, I can do that, yeah. Another thing that goes on it. You need the other one right there. Hey, did you pour the eggs in yet? I'll pay you five dollars if you eat a raw egg. I'm good. Yeah? There's no way I'm eating it. I don't even like eggs. Oh. Go on and mix that up, girl. Go on and mix that up. Dump these. Don't put all, we don't need to use all of them. Now we're going to pour Chocolate the. Chocolate chips. Yeah. They're white. Don't pour, that's good. Okay. Cause we don't want, I mean, if you want a little more, it all depends like when we bite it, we want it to melt in our mouth. Good. Mmm. Did it taste good, Mia? The white chocolate is so good. Gonna wrap this up for about an hour. Alright guys, so this is the next day. We didn't come back on and show you because our red velvet didn't come out like we wanted them to. It's like mini cake. Yeah, it's giving red velvet, but it's more of like a fluffy cake cookie. I don't know what we did. I think we should have, instead of the oil, we should have did the butter. But all in all, they're bust. They look good. The only thing is that the white chocolate chip didn't melt. Depend on nothing or no one So why would you show up So uninvited Just change my mind like that Please don't take this personal but you It's kind of nasty Don't do that I don't really taste the flavor Just this one takes one Are they even cookies? No, <laughs> they're cake Take one, Papa Y'all made these? Yes Take one It just doesn't taste good 
Like, I feel like the flavor <laughs> of red velvet is just nasty. What is it that you don't like? It just doesn't t it tastes wrong. Try it. <laughs> Here. Here. Mom. Mia said more for me. <laughs> yeah. These are good. You're getting taller and taller by the minute. This is ridiculous. Hey, I'm not liking it, but I'm loving the way the sun is hitting my face. I, there's no sun on me. No, I don't like the way it looks. Weird. I look my better hair. with the sun. Yeah. My hair. I like your hair. I feel like you're twinning. We're twinning we're today twinning. without even knowing. We got dressed in two different bathrooms and we're twinning. The only difference is she's not wearing black. I told her to wear black. I have black sweats. I love this outfit that I got, y'all. So this is the fit of the day. I got this from Shein. Top from Shein, bottom from Shein, back from Burlington. Nike socks, Panda Dunks, and... My outfit, my mom's closet. Period. These are from Ross. Socks from my mom's closet. It's from Walmart. This shirt, it's a Dia. And then these leggings, Forever 21. My shoes are from Foot Locker. Fit from H and M. Got the Air Forces on. Uh, we got the Nike socks. Okay, you you fly. You cool? Yeah, I'm cool. I don't know what it is about these teeny boppers, and don't say I'm cringe. You are cringe. Nobody uses that term. Probably. They don't want to wear sneakers anymore. It's always just Crocs or what? bubble slides. No, like if it's Jordans, then yeah, but like Crocs are just comfortable. But no, that's just an easy way out. You gotta cover your feet up. It's cold outside. You gotta put something on to cover your toes. I'm taking these off. Why do you prefer to wear Crocs? Because they're easy to slide on and they're really comfortable. And Is that a Stanley Cup? Today is December 22nd. We got three days, baby. We got three days till Christmas. I'm playing the crib all day. I got my comfy mental health matters hoodie on. Shout out to Timo. I absolutely love it. And we got the mama bear slippers on. To you guys about yesterday, the event we went to in Uptown was so freaking cute. Lights, the setup was just amazing. We were going to go ice skating, but my kids don't have experience. I went ice skating once upon a time and almost broke a leg. Now put me on some rollerblades and I could do it. I'm going to go ice skating with three kids. And mom is not even a pro. Who, who's going to hold two up? They had that and they also had snow tubing. But why were they charging $30 per person to go snow tubing? When we could just go back home, go back to New York, get a, get a sled and go down the hills like we used to do when we were kids. It was beautiful. They had beautiful vendors, food, lights. Highly recommend it if you're in the Charlotte area. I have a lot of gifts I need to wrap in a short period of time. So I'm about to go get the stash because the stash ain't in the house. You have inquisitive kids like mine, especially that Mia, you can't keep nothing. 
not even a little bit of anything because she is going to be on it. She want to know where everything is, who, what, when, where, how. That's just Nina. So I was like, let me take advantage now and get this out the way. I'm probably going to have to end up going back to the Dollar Tree because I think five rolls of wrapping paper is not enough. It may be enough if I stretch it. The house store is literally like right up the street from me, so it's not a big thing. But I just want to get everything wrapped, put away, because Christmas is approaching. I can't really show y'all too much, because Nia, she be watching it big. I know it's ghetto, y'all. Don't even come for me. But ain't my bags cute? These is pink garbage bags. Target, but I had to hide the stuff in the garbage bags. I don't got no black garbage bags, but I got to be quick, because this was processed, y'all. I carried all of this in one go around. Santa came through. Santa always comes through. And my mom, my grandma, like my family, they always show up for the kids too. I'll probably go live on Christmas so you guys can see what they got. Or I wonder if I can block Mia from watching this video. Hmm. That was a process. I carried all those in one shot. That's what my day's going to entail. I'm going to be wrapping gifts. I'm going to play some Christmas music. I might even make some hot chocolate. I don't know. Do you guys wrap your gifts ahead of time? Or do you guys wrap your gifts on Christmas Eve? Do you guys believe in letting your kids open up like one gift on Christmas Eve? That was a big tradition since I was a little girl. My grandmother would always let us open one gift. And we used to go around the tree and try to see who had the most gifts, count them, shake the boxes. And you know me, I was looking for the biggest box. I was a little sad at first, thinking about like, you know, my situation and like not going home for the holidays. But it's all good. You know, you got to make the best out of everything. Again, I say it all the time, thankful. I'm thankful for, you know, the opportunity that I was that I was given to even you know take a big leap and explore life you know on my own it's I have my moments but then I just think about I try to turn things into a positive because things could all things could be way worse you know hopefully I see my family soon but I want to wish you guys a Merry Christmas in case if I don't say it on Christmas Merry Christmas to each and every one of you I pray for you guys to have a wonderful you know day with your family your loved ones and also a happy new year I don't know about you guys, but 2023 was like real rough. 2023 shook me up, did me dirty, okay? Did me dirty, but it also taught me a lot of things. So I'm just looking forward to better things, bigger blessings, you know, more opportunities coming my way. But once you know better, you do better. And I just feel like 2023 almost broke me, but 2024, I'm coming back with like everything. Everything that I feel like I lost or didn't get or was stopping me is I'm going to get it tenfold. Like it's coming. So I just stay prayed up and, you know, just put good back into the universe and just speak good to yourself. Even though it's a work in progress, I'm always a work in progress. But one thing that I can say that has always helped me and continuously helps me whenever I feel like life is just trying to get the best of me is my kids. My kids have been literally my life jacket through everything that has been thrown at me. It'd be like in a domino effect. It's like when one thing happens, something else happens. It just it just keeps trickling down. And I realized that once my faith started to get stronger, then things really started to try to come at me. Then that's when I feel like the, the enemy was attacking me and trying to stop me from praying and stop doing things that I was doing, like to distract me. So, you know, I say all that to say just... You have to believe in something. Even if you don't believe in a, you know, God or whatever your religion is, you got to hold on to some type of faith because, <sighs> baby, life, what, what do I say all the time, y'all? Life be what? Y'all know life be life in. Greater days are ahead. That's how you just have to look at it. So with that being said, I'm going to close the vlog out because y'all know I'll be, I could be long-winded. Happy holidays to each and every one of you. I'm giving you guys an air hug right now. From the Carolinas. I love you guys so much. I hope that you enjoyed this vlog. If you did, give me a thumbs up. And also in the comment section, do me one thing and do me a favor and just comment Merry Christmas to somebody. Anybody that you don't know, just respond to them and comment Merry Christmas so that we can get some engagement and you guys can just show up for somebody who may possibly need the support. With that being said, I'll see you guys in my next upload. Simply share, simply share. Oh, oh, oh.